Welcome to Club Dino. This is Scott and I wanted to go through how to find the special numbers in a Dino. Are you a new Dino buyer looking to buy a Dino and want to make sure the numbers are correct as delivered from the factory? Or perhaps you're a current owner and you want to go to Ferrari Red Book Classy K certification. And before you spend $10,000, you want to make sure the yes column is going to be checked for all the original items. Well, let's go through it today. There's one source for the factory information and that's Matthias Bartz. So if you email Matthias Bartz, you'll find out what your number is. We have 08492 in the shop and we have an engine number. That'll be located on the car in one location. It's difficult to find. The gearbox number is located in one location also and is very easy to find. And then the Scaglietti body number of 3059 which is located in at least 10 locations and depending if this is a seller's car, uh, you'll be limited on what you can look at. You will find them on body panels, chrome panels, and vinyl interior trim panels, and we'll go through that. So let's look at the first one. If you're a, a mechanic with a boroscope or a hobbyist with a boroscope, you'll have a better, you have a hedge on it already. You're going to have to paw through a lot of hoses, high tension wires, electrical bundles, and, and uh, breather hoses to get down onto the ledge of the passenger side aft ledge of the block. I have really cheated here because I've got the coolant hoses off and we can pull back in here, almost <laughs> unobstructed in, as a Dino goes. Yeah, I know that's an embellishment. Um, there, let's see, can we get a good shot of, and hold the camera, okay. All right, get the light out of here, get behind me, there we go. There's a nice shot of the engine type on the left. What about the engine? Not the engine number. Okay, second hand needed. Pull you back. And 12064. That checks out right away. There we go. That's it. So you can see that ledge. Ooh, there's a nice shot with both this engine type number and the engine number on the right. They span that whole time. This is really important. A lot of times when these cars are refurbished, the mechanics want to deck the engine. Of course, these numbers go away as soon as they grind it down. Right now we see them deep in the yes. So that's, that's an easy, that's a difficult one. Let's get to the easy one, the transaxle. Come behind the car, slip your camera under the passenger side, rear aft of the tab of the tab for the transaxle and the number is quite easy to see as 3124 Edward just like on the Matthias Bartz paperwork and the skin get back up to the Scalietti numbers and first one to find that's easy to find are the hinges on the trunk 3059 is the number from Bart's, and that confirms on both hinges. There's also a, another number on the back of the tab for the tank. This may or may not be easy to see on that. And then also coming into the cabin is where you're going to have access to chrome body and vinyl first one i like to do is the edge here if you take the two screws use a flathead screwdriver pull them off take this chrome piece remove the chrome piece 3059 next one is the door panel this is going to be very difficult to see it's on the face right down there can you catch it on the reflection then the next one, also on the door, trim panel, will be right here. Remove the screw on the interior trim panel. Pull it back just a little bit on there. And you can see 3059 right across there also. Now, if, the, if you're the owner, you can remove this section of the door, and you'll find it on the end tab there too. But... In doing this, you can't just take the panel off. You need to take the alignment striker off for the door. And owners may get really nervous if you change the alignment of the door. So we've got body, chrome, a sample. Now there is another chrome piece all along here with the number on the tab down here. 
than this chrome piece if they if you're allowed to take it off this does have some alignment putty on it so depending on how comfortable you, your seller is they will on the vinyl pieces there are about 10 at least 10 pieces it's easy to take these two screws off first whip it around and look and look sorry no Right there, there's some light, 3059. 